All right, so welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be talking softwares, CapCut versus Premiere Pro. I want to give you some pros and cons if you're looking to get started with video editing. So stay tuned, stick around. I want to explain to you what you need to know. All right, so I've built this channel here just using Premiere Pro. And I got to say, if you want professional results, Premiere Pro is the way to go. Just about 90% of videos you've seen on this channel, I've made in Premiere Pro. I think when it comes to like color grading, using different softwares like Adobe After Effects, Adobe Photoshop, those programs with Premiere Pro, you can get a lot more done. So I would say if you want professional results, definitely go with Premiere Pro. The only issue when it comes to Premiere Pro, I would say for a lot of people would be, it's not free. So you won't be able to get it if you're not willing to pay the monthly charge or whatever. If you're just looking to get started, then that's going to be a problem for most people. The next issue I would say when it comes to Premiere Pro versus CapCut is the learning curve. There's a lot more to learn. There's a lot more to do when it comes to Premiere Pro. So it really won't be a quick in and out when it comes to editing videos. But besides those two, if you're willing to pay for it, then Premiere Pro is the way to go if you want those professional results. Trust me. Look at my videos. So now we could talk about CapCut. CapCut Pros, I would say, is it's free. So what that means is you could jump in today and start editing videos right now with CapCut. You may not be able to get professional results like the Mac Pro, but you would be able to start. Another pro for CapCut is the effects is so much easier to use. Everything is already pre-built. So you basically just plug and play with everything. So I feel like if you want to just get in and out and have your video done quickly, CapCut is most certainly the route you need to be on. Another pro for CapCut is for desktop and mobile. So you can edit your videos on the fly or at home on your laptop. Now for the cons when it comes to CapCut is you don't have the professional features like Premiere Pro when it comes to color grading. So you won't really be able to do a lot when it comes to being detailed with your videos. So overall, I want to summarize it like this. If you're looking to get started right now, video editing, CapCut is definitely available, mobile and desktop. But if you're looking for professional results, professional videos that you hope one day people are going to watch on the big screen, definitely you're going to need Premiere Pro. So that's it. I hope this video was clear enough to help you make a choice today. So that's about all it boils down to. Free today or professional results. So I hope this video was able to help you make a choice. Be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. And I'm out.